But I remember the fear of heading out trying to capture the first 4,000 pound great white shark. There was no book on how to do this. One of the challenges is the educational system in the STEM world and the sciences world, they've, they've struggled to make science cool and compelling for the kids. So they lose the kids, but we got the white shark. That tag from now on, every time she stuck her fin out of the water for five years was gonna tell us where she was. And because she was a big female, she was gonna show us where the baby sharks were. Because we don't know where the baby sharks are. We just want people to have ocean on the brain. And so you can do that at school because the ocean is fascinating and what kid doesn't have some part explorer in him or her? Did you know there are explorers still today? It's not just something you read about in a book. You know, the way the world is moving today, if you don't have a science, technology, engineering, or math background in your education, it's gonna be difficult to have a job. If we can captivate the kids by including them in solving these white shark puzzles, while well, we got that attention, why not try to leverage it to give them the skills they need to succeed for tomorrow? So, because the white shark is cool, we're making science cool. So thank you for having me, thank your teachers, and Captain Brett and I are happy to take any questions you may have.